Okay, boys and girls, I'm so glad you're here for Ecology Club today. Uh, we have a nice activity for you to do. Um, just one problem, I've been collecting water bottles all day long. You can see that they're mostly full of water. Um, it's really a shame that kids are spending so much money for water that they throw away. Okay, we, we really ought to do something about this. I, I just don't understand kids throwing away all this money. It's such a shame, all the money and the plastic that we waste every year. Before we uh, start brainstorming to solve this problem, I want to show you a fast video. One. Our goal is to convince the student body to use recyclable water bottles and not disposable ones. We anticipate that the students may not care about this issue, but with facts and figures, we hope to convince them otherwise. It takes half a cup of petroleum to make a single water bottle. Can you believe it? There's an island of garbage twice the size of Texas. That's just disgusting. GSTMS Ecology Club works together as a community to spread awareness about global climate change and to inform our peers. Other schools have banned the disposable bottle and successfully sold tons of reusable water bottles. We're doing this project to stop global climate change and to make our school greener. We believe this will work because kids will know that to have a healthy earth to live on in the future, we have to act now. With determination, I believe we can make a difference. This video has six components to help us with our program. Can you name those six components? Rachel? We need to come up with a plan to prevent climate change. Diana? We need to have a school plan. Julia? We have to know what problems we, can, we will anticipate. Nick? We know that every effort counts. Patrick? We need to learn what other schools are doing. JB? We believe we can make a difference. Okay, now let's get started. First, we bought reusable water bottles to sell. Next, we gave the students surveys to see just how many students would use reusable water bottles. We sold a lot of them. And the students did start using more reusable water bottles. We have a refilling station at some of our water fountains at school. Students are recycling more too. In our school, our survey showed that most students use disposable bottles every day. The next highest number of students use their disposable bottles multiple times a day. The remaining students either use it once a week or every other day or once a month. The greatest amount of students said that to get rid of their store-bought water bottles, they recycled them. A small portion threw theirs in the trash or filled them. The top reason GCMS students don't use a reusable water bottle is because they think it's inconvenient to carry around. The second most reason was that they forgot it. Over 120 students said that they did not use a recyclable water bottle. Nearly 90 said they sometimes did, and only 70 answered that they did use them. Our research at our school shows that over 50 students fill up their reusable or disposable bottles once a day. Over 40 fills theirs multiple times a day, and the remaining students are filled theirs every day, once a month, or once a week.